Out of shows now. Margarita at forty dollars. Lisa at thirty. Keith at twenty. Back with this. Name the chemical element added to water supplies and toothpaste to prevent cavities. Margarita. Fluoride. Fluoride is exactly what it is. Just kidding. Keith for the buzzer. Keith, I know you've got the knowledge. They keep beating you there. <laughs> Give me the one word to complete this line from the song Dixie. I wish I was in the land, Lisa. Uh, Dixie. Hmm? <laughs> Knowing the song, it's I wish I was in the land of cotton. Ah. Old times there, not forgotten. You lose five. Look away, look away. No, Dixie's what we wanted. Down to 25. This word describes the line that comes at the end of a joke in a popular party drink. Marguerite. Punchline. Punch. Punch it is in Mar Marguerite goes to 50 now. And a $25 lead. In 1824, a sea captain named William Driver gave the name Old Glory to Keith. United States flag. You got it. Keith is on the board of 25. Yes. <laughs> However, time now for an instant bargain. And Marguerite, you've got a much bigger lead. You've got a $25 lead, and you might like this. Your art selection will blossom with a limited edition graphic by Susan Rehost entitled Amaryllis. This beautiful stereograph is numbered and signed by the artist. And it's finished by Martin Lawrence Gallery. And this piece of art is normally priced at $750, but it can be yours today for just $10. On sale of the century. That's very lovely. That is very lovely. Do you like this, Marguerite? It's gorgeous. It's really nice. And I know there's probably a sales surprise. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you, do you assume that now? Just because you... Because does that mean you're not going to buy it? Is that what it means? You're, are you going to do that again? Would you do that if I gave you... Uh, sure. <laughs> Marguerite, oh. I will give you this beautiful painting and $400 in cash for 10 bucks. You would still have a $15 oh. lead. <laughs> Going once. <laughs> Going twice. No sale. No generous. sale surprise either. No. no? Okay. <laughs> I was listening. <laughs> Hanging on to the $25. Yeah, you think if you don't buy it, there's a good chance yeah, it's right. there with your luck. No wonder this bird can't fly. It can weigh more than 300 pounds. Lisa, 100? making it the world's largest bird, the ostrich it is. Lisa in the second place. Yes. On November the 8th, on November the 8th, 1984, who was quoted as saying, I did my best. I worked my heart out. Marguerite? Mondale. That's exactly who did it. Walter Mondale and Marguerite has another five. Two neighboring states, both towns named Kansas City. Kansas is one. What's the other? Lisa. Missouri. Missouri, yes. Kansas City, Kansas. Kansas City, Missouri. Lisa pulls it within twenty dollars for Marguerite. In the Disney classic, what name does the mirror give when the queen Marguerite? Uh, mirror, mirror on the wall. Uh, mirror, mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of us all? Oh, the judge gave you a moment there. What name, I said, does the mirror give when the queen asks who's the fairest oh. of them all? No white. No white is what the mirror says. And you lose five down to fifty dollars, but still at fifteen dollar need of Elisa. Considered by historians as one of our most successful presidents, this Democrat led the U.S. through World War One. Name him. Marguerite. Um, Woodrow Wilson. That's exactly who it is. You got that five dollars right back. Marguerite going to fifty-five. Yes. Thinking of Woodrow Wilson. When Wilson served as president of Princeton University, the mother of one of his students begged him to make the college co-educational in order to remove, quote, the false glamour with which the two sexes see each other. Mr. Wilson replied, my dear madam, that's the very thing we want to preserve at all costs. We'll be right back.